Hello everyone, Happy New Year. It is now 2016. I can't believe that 2015's already come and gone. 2015 was such an amazing year, particularly for me and hopefully for many of you too as well. I just gone to like six conventions and that was just probably a personal record for mine and my own personal experience. And I'm looking forward to probably going to even more this year. IkiCon is coming up in Austin. I'm kind of like undecided right now if I want to go or not, but if I can, I can. And uh, if I can't, then the next convention will be UshiCon, which is one that takes place, you know, in North Austin or Round Rock. That's a completely 18 and up only. It's one of my favorite conventions. It's small and it feels more like everybody knows each other, like a small town convention. Like in itself, although it's not from a small town, it's in North Austin. But it's everyone almost knows each other there, especially if you've been going for at least like more than two more than two or three years and you get to know everybody. I've even got to meet the and personally know the founder. And I'm not sure if I'm gonna be going alone or with someone this time. Last year I went with someone and hopefully I, hopefully someone can go with me this year and I'm going to see if my cousin Roland can go with me, uh, but he's uh, not sure at the time, uh, at, at, at this time right now. And But 2015, it's a very good year to reflect. A lot of good things happened. Like I got to meet Stan Lee. I got to meet a bunch of unexpected things that happened, like with my unexpected picture with Ming-Na Wen, get to reunite with some f uh, former uh, uh, voice actors I, I used to, uh, from uh, previous conventions that I got to, I don't know why I said former, there still are. <laughs> and, and I'm just wondering, like, uh, if this year is going to be just as good, because I don't know if it's going to top it, because it was pretty amazing. And I, I just want to try to put out more content for you guys this year. I'm... Actually, believe it or not, thinking of maybe starting a second YouTube channel where it becomes like more like professional looking and where I try to like have a YouTube partnership, right? Because right? I, I can't do that with this one because I use a lot of copyrighted content, you know, for the sake of entertaining you guys. And I'm going to be a little more careful about it because I've been watching like other YouTubers in my spare time and I get like inspired by it. Like, and I have someone I, I know who works in a studio who can help me out with this new channel that I want to do. Of course, I also got to like upgrade my equipment and my software. That's probably not going to happen until after tax season, you know, after the more funds come my way and I can easily afford it. And also my birthday's this this month, so I'll probably be getting some more there. I'll just say give me money or gift cards. I need I needed more I need more equipment. <laughs> and okay and uh, so that's one thing for you guys to look forward to. And I'm gonna really like give it my my all in that new YouTube channel. I haven't really decided on a name yet. But when it does happen I'll be sure to post a new video, uh just a short one so that it's quick and easy to you know, to find and understand what the which video it is to all you subscribers uh, to this channel uh, to help migrate over there because I'll probably be spending more of my time and energy on that new channel. Uh, but that doesn't mean I'm abandoning this channel. I'll still upload to this, you know, for anything that I can't upload in that channel because of like maybe copyright strikes, then I'll move to this one so that you guys can still see them, e even if I'm unable to put it on a YouTube partnership channel. But in the meantime, look forward to that, and uh, Happy New Year. Hope you guys, year New Year turns out really great. I hope mine does as well. And thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you next time.